families lost their homes and most of their belongings in the Thomas fire. Yeah, today those families are trying to get back on track. Cake on Ice Chef Nguyen joins us now live with a heartwarming story of neighbor helping neighbor. Jeff? Well, Jeff and Elsa, earlier this evening we saw ash raining down on us, and right now there is still the smell of smoke in the air. But take a look at all of this, all of this clothing on this front lawn. You've got boys' clothing here, girls' clothing there, infants over there, adults there, and then shoes right here. So if you are in need of help, you can show up here, and the only rule is that there is no judgment. So just load it up anywhere over here. The front of Justin Ships and Sarah Masterson's home may look like a yard sale, but the only currency here is goodwill. It's a swap me without changing hands. You see, this house is a stone's throw from dozens of others that were destroyed in the Thomas fire. Today, thick, heavy smoke still loomed over many parts of Ventura. Awesome. Thank you guys so much for doing no that. Worries. Seriously, we really appreciate your generosity. Masterson had to bail from her home on Tuesday. But when the evacuation was lifted, she got on Instagram and reached out to anyone with a big heart and some helping hands. People donating gently used items and it's getting into the hands of the people that need them. Her front lawn became a pop-up donation center filled with shoes, clothing and food. Tucker Hopkins and his girlfriend drove all the way from Venice Beach with a truckload of stuff. I had a couple friends of mine lost houses and lost homes. And uh, I know a bunch of the firemen and kind of first responders who are up here responding to it. So it's the least I could do. Plenty of people have been showing up the past few days needing help. Some have come by to grab things for their neighbors or relatives who were too intimidated to ask for themselves. I was just so amazed and it just, again, really reaffirmed in my heart that people are fundamentally really, really good. Tonight, we saw some college students who graduated from Ventura High School coming back to their hometown with bags and bags of clothing after they got wind of this on social media. And for this selfie generation, this may be picture perfect. It's just everyone's taking what they can to make our community whole again. So this place doesn't really have any official operating hours other than you can show up here between sunup and sundown. Sarah Masterson says that she's getting a lot of stuff and if she gets more, she may need help from organizations like the Red Cross. But for the time being, as you can see, a lot of stuff is being dropped off here. That's the latest from here. Jeff and Elsa, we'll send it back to you.